शांति दिस इज दी साकार मुरली ऑफ ट्वेंटी ऑफ फेब्रुअरी ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फोर एसेंस स्वीट चिल्ड्रेन यू हैव टू डू रियल स्परिचुअल सर्विस विद योर बॉडीज माइंड्स एंड वेल्थ इट इज ओनली बाई योर डूइंग स्परिचुअल सर्विस डेट भारत विल बिकम द गोल्डन एज क्वेश्चन What should you constantly remember in order to remain free from worry? When will you be able to remain free from worry? Answer: In order to remain free from worry, always remember that this drama is created absolutely accurately. Whatever happens is absolutely accurate according to the drama. However, you children cannot remain free from worry at this time. When you reach your karma tith stage, you will be free from worry. Very good yoga is needed for that. Yogi and jnani children cannot remain hidden. Om Shanti, the purifier God Shiva speaks. The father has explained that no bodily being can be called God. people also know that the purifier can only be god shri krishna cannot be called the purifier the poor people are very confused it is only when the thread in bharat is tangled that se baba has to come no one except the father can untangle it he alone is the purifier se baba only you children know this and that too is number wise according to the effort you make although you are sitting here and you listen to this every day you don't remain aware that you are sitting with se baba that he is present in this one teaching us purifying us and telling us these methods you become spinners of the discuss of self realization you receive the knowledge of the creator and creation you conquer lust and become conquerors of the world so that father is the purifier he is also the creator of the new creation you are now making effort to attain the unlimited kingdom each one of you understands that you claim your fortune of the kingdom from se baba even this is not understood accurately some know this a little and some don't know it at all Say Baba says I am the purifier if anyone comes and ask me I can give him my introduction the father has also given you his introduction say Baba says I enter an ordinary body this body is ordinary he is standing at the top of the tree he is shown standing in the impure world and also shown doing tapasya down below say Baba also teaches this one how to do tapasya Sri Baba is teaching Raj Yoga. Down below is Adi Dev, and at the top is Adi Nath. Brackets Lord. You children can explain. We Brahmins are children of Sri Baba. You too are children of Sri Baba, but you don't know it. God is one, and all the rest are brothers. The Father says, "I only teach my children. I only teach and make into deities those who recognize me." Bharat itself was heaven and it is now hell. Only those who conquer lust will become conquerors of the world. I am establishing the golden world. Bharat has been in the golden age and then gone into the iron age many times. No one knows this. No one knows the creator or the beginning, middle and end of creation. I am knowledgeful. This is your aim and objective. I enter this one's ordinary body and give you knowledge. You now have to become pure. By conquering those vices, you will become conquerors of the world. All of you children are making effort. You do spiritual service, not physical service, with your bodies, minds, and wealth. This is called spiritual knowledge. This is not devotion. The ages for devotion are the copper and iron ages. They are also called the night of Brahma. 
वेयर इज दी गोल्डन एंड सिल्वर एजेज आर कॉल्ड दी डे ऑफ ब्रह्मा इफ समन हु टीचेस दी गीता कम्स यू शुड एक्सप्लेन टू हिम डेट देयर इज अ मिस्टेक इन दी गीता हु स्पोक दी गीता हु टॉट राज योगा हु सेट डेट बाय कॉन्करिंग लस्ट यू बिकम दी कॉन्करर्स ऑफ दी वर्ल्ड दिस लक्ष्मी एंड नारायण बिकेम दी कॉन्करर्स ऑफ दी वर्ल्ड डिड दे नॉट He sat and explained to them the secrets of their eighty-four births. No matter who it is, they have to come here to receive knowledge. I teach you children, but amongst you too, some don't understand very much, and this is why it is remembered a handful out of multi millions. Some only know five percent about who I am and what I am. You have to know the Father and remember Him accurately. Why do you not remember me constantly? You say Baba I forget to remember you. Oh can you not remember Baba? In fact the father understands that this is something that requires effort. Nevertheless he continues to pump you to make effort. Oh you forget the father who takes you to the ocean of milk and makes you into the masters of the world. Maya will definitely make you forget. It will take time. It isn't that because Maya will definitely make you forget. You can sit there cool. You can sit there coolly. No, you definitely have to make effort. You have to conquer lust. Constantly remember me alone, and your sins will be absolved. Just as I say to each of you, children, child. Similarly, even if the highest judge comes. I would say child to him too because I am God the highest on high I alone teach you the highest study of all to enable you to receive the status of princes and princesses the father says I teach this one this one then becomes Sri Krishna Brahma and Saraswati then become Lakshmi and Narayan this family path continues those on the path of isolation cannot teach raj yoga both king and queen are needed those people go abroad and say that they are teaching raj yoga however they say that happiness is like the droppings of a crow so how can they teach raj yoga therefore you children should have that enthusiasm however children are still young they haven't yet become mature they need curries for maturity the father tells you this is the community of ravan you call out oh purifier come so is this an impure world or a pure world you understand that you are residents of hell is this the deity community is this the kingdom of rama do you not belong to the kingdom of ravan at this time everyone in the kingdom of ravan has a devilish intellect Now who would make a devilish intellect divine ask four to five such questions that would make people think it is the duty of you children to give the father's introduction the tree grows gradually then there will be a lot of expansion maya too puts you in a spin and knocks you down completely many die in boxing and many die here too they fall into vice and die they then have to make effort from the beginning vice completely kills them whatever rust they had removed by becoming pure from impure all of that income is lost they then have to make effort anew you can't say that you mustn't allow someone to come no you have to explain to that one everything you had earned on the pilgrimage of remembrance and by studying is destroyed they fall down so so low if you repeatedly continue to fall down you would be told to get out you are given a trial once or twice you are forgiven twice and it then becomes a hopeless case they would go there but in a dirty class this is what would be said in comparison those who receive a completely low status are said to be in a dirty class there are maids servants cremators and also maids and servants of the subjects the father knows that he is teaching you that he teaches you every 5000 years those people speak of hundreds of thousands of years 
as you progress further they will begin to say truly this is a matter of 5000 years it is the same great war however they cannot stay on the pilgrimage of remembrance day by day it continues to become too late it is remembered a lot of time has gone by and a little time remains all of those matters refer to this time there is a little time left to become pure the war is just ahead ask your heart am i on the pilgrimage of remembrance when new people come when when new people come you children should definitely make them fill in a form only when they fill in a form can you then explain to them if someone doesn't want to understand what would he put on the form so many people come here just like that tell them you call out to the father oh purifier come so this is surely an impure world this is why you call out oh purifier come and make us pure some become this and others don't baba receives many letters all of you write sib baba care of brahma sib baba also says i enter an ordinary body i tell him his story of 84 births no other human being knows the beginning middle and end of creation the father has now told you baba has had these pictures etc made by giving you children divine visions baba only teaches you souls souls quickly become bodiless you have to consider yourselves to be separate from those bodies baba say children may you be soul conscious may you be bodiless i am teaching you souls this is the meeting of souls with the supreme soul this is called the meeting of the confluence is ganges water does not purify anyone sages holy men rishis and munis etc all go to bathe in the ganges how can the ganges be the purifier god speaks lust is the greatest enemy by conquering it you will become conquerors of the world neither the ganges nor the ocean says this the father the ocean of knowledge is explaining to you in order to conquer that lust constantly remember me alone and you will become pure imbibe divine virtues don't cause anyone sorrow the number one sorrow is to use the sword of lust that causes you sorrow from its beginning through the middle to the end it doesn't exist in the golden age that is the pure world there is no one impure there just as you claim the kingdom through the power of yoga so children are born there through the power of yoga the kingdom of ravan doesn't exist there you people burn an effigy of ravan but you don't know when you started to burn him ravan doesn't exist in the kingdom of rama the father is sitting here and explaining these matters to you which have to be understood he explains very well but according to how much each one of you studies every cycle so you will study now everything can be known through the efforts you make there is also the subject of physical service if you can't serve through the mind then serve through words and deeds it is very easy to serve through words first of all there is service through the mind that is man mana bhav stay on the pilgrimage of remembrance consider yourself to be a soul and remember the father take teachings from baba there are many who are unable to remember the father you wouldn't say that they are unable to remember this knowledge they are unable to remember the one constantly how will you receive strength if you don't remember him the father is the almighty authority by remembering him by remembering him you will receive power this is called strength if someone does good service through deeds he can receive a good status if you don't serve through deeds what status will you receive there are the subjects these are incognito matters and have to be understood 
those people speak of yoga but they don't understand that you claim the sovereignty of the world by having yoga no one knows that children are born there through the power of yoga this is explained to you but nevertheless after half the cycle you become slaves of maya maya doesn't leave you alone even now you now have to become sibaba slaves do not become slaves of bodily beings it is now that you are called brothers and sisters in order for you to become pure then you have to go beyond that too you have to consider yourselves to be brothers there shouldn't be even there shouldn't even be the reason of brother and sister whatever happens is absolutely accurate according to the dra- drama the drama is very accurate the father is free from worry this one would definitely have some worries only when you reach your karma tith stays will you remain free from worry until then something or other will continue to happen very good yoga is needed baba is now emphasizing yoga it is about this that you say you repeatedly forget the father complains you forget the father who gives you so many treasures the father knows who has knowledge and who doesn't knowledgeable souls can remain hidden they would quickly give the proof of service therefore all of these matters have to be understood acha to the sweetest beloved long lost and now found children love remembrance and good morning from the mother the father bab dada the spiritual father says namaste to the spiritual children and the spiritual children say namaste to the spiritual father essence for dharna number 1 don't be defeated while boxing maya don't just sit down coolly and become slack in making effort have courage and do service second this drama is created accurately therefore don't worry about anything in order to reach your karma tith stays stay in remembrance of the father don't become a slave to any bodily being blessing may you experience the speciality of contentment in doing service according to srimad and become an embodiment of success whatever service you do whether any students come or not just remain content with yourself have the faith if i remain contained the masses will definitely work therefore do not be unhappy if the number of students does not increase it doesn't matter at least it has accumulated in your account and they would have received the masses if you yourself are contained any expense would have been worthwhile you carried out the task according to srimad and to obey srimad is also to become an embodiment of success slogan give weak souls power and you will receive blessings from them slogan give weak souls power and you will receive blessings from them om shanti